Uh, hello everyone, I am Avadsa. I am dedicated functional consultant into D365. Uh, this is my YouTube channel over here. I am sharing my um, my experience towards D D365 with you. So in today's video, uh, we are going to download multiple trial balance into a one single Excel. So we'll see how it will work into the system. Uh, so let me go to the general ledger module. In general mo ledger module, we we have a inquiry and reports. In inquiry and reports, we have a trial balance. So in trial balance, if I will, uh, uh, I mean, uh, calculate the balances, system will only uh, filter the uh, I mean, run the trial balance for this uh, selected particular legal entity. Even if I will download the export this Excel, a system will only uh, download the trial balance for this particular legal entity. So suppose I want um, uh, multiple legal entity and all legal entity trial balance together then how can I uh, do it. Uh, so this is I can do with trial balance snapshots. So we have a new feature called as in trial balance snapshot. Over here uh, we have a add trial balance snapshot option. I am just clicking on it. This is my legal entity I have selected this is my dimension set so I can select maximum 10 or 11 dimension over here right now I am selecting just uh, main account or maybe main account and business unit also I can select MA plus BU yeah and uh, this is a posting layer it is um, right now a current only then uh, select fiscal year we have an option means I can select whatsoever financial year I want to select uh, from this drop down ok then we have an option to select current fiscal year then we have an option to select current plus previous fiscal year and current plus two previous fiscal year so I am selecting just current fiscal year once I will select the uh, current fiscal year and I will click on ok uh, uh, you can see here there is one line added by the system but here snapshot status is uh, not started so for that I need to run sna uh, snapshot once and once I will run it is uh, right now in processing stage once it will complete it is changed to completed stage so now uh, what I am doing I am going into the general ledger module again in general ledger module uh, we have a calendar if you if you'll see ledger calendar here uh, we have a monthly calendar if you will see we have a monthly calendar okay so this trial balance will run uh, will generate on monthly calendar basis now uh, if I want to go I want to change this INMF then also I can do otherwise from here only I can change here uh, in ledger INMF financial dimension sets main account plus BU current uh, and this is my current fiscal year ok I will again run snapshot let me wait once this is uh, snapshot status is completed will download excel file uh, so uh, let me do one thing here we have a open in excel option if I will click over here system will uh, enable the download option I have downloaded this now I will uh, yeah this is downloaded so now I will uh, go to the download page into the system and I will open this Excel yeah and now this two snapshot is completed I ha I'm opening this Excel yeah uh, maybe two Excel is opened I don't know so here system is loading the uh, data yeah. 
so this data is loaded by the system dimension tree name is written over here here is a period 1 and dimension value 1 and 2 you can able to see here okay we have option to select uh, till 11 dimension it is a dynamic form uh, that is very helpful if we have a multiple dimension and main account we can also uh, download as on the basis of the same now what I will do let me go to, uh, let me select any one of the main account into the dim uh, from dimension value so if you will see here uh, this will start from January suppose my for, uh, I have selected here um, I mean you INMF then it will start with April okay so if you will see here uh, this is my uh, 200 debit entry this is my credit entry okay again uh, yeah again 4500 debit entry so my my closing balance uh, will be changed as per this okay so every month uh, you can see that we have a we have a balance and this is my last day uh, last month balance okay so that's how it will work uh, why this is a I mean if you will see here uh, if I will remove this 001 or maybe blank then it will show you exact uh, 13 count because uh, system will uh, showcase uh, last balance two time um, last month balance two time because it's uh, like uh, system will showcase here um, one closing balance uh, for a last day of the year and till now system will showcase monthly balance for 12 time with this combination suppose I will now I will select blank then for these uh, combinations again system will uh, showcase us 13 balance 12 for uh, each month and, and one is for a uh, year and uh, last date of the year uh, additionally okay so this is how this uh, functionality will work but here if you will see um, if you will see here um, this ledger uh, have only ledger name have only balance of the USMF but if we will uh, go to here filter and we will remove this filter and will refresh the data then uh, system will run a trial balance for USMF and INMF both see ok so that's how it will work uh, suppose uh, now we will uh, see one more uh, snapshot for USMF only this is not for a uh, uh, multiple running for multiple legal entity this is just I want to showcase you how uh, the view in case I will select the current and previous two fiscal year uh, in my option period option ok so run this snapshot one suppose I have added all the uh, trial balance from multiple all the legal entity one by one and I have removed the filter here you will able to find all the data of all the uh, all the legal entity into the single trial balance report so that's how it will work it is a very important and a good functionality you can use with uh, I mean you can uh, view all the data and details in a single particular Excel related to trial balance over here you can uh, do pivot and all as per your requirement now I what I will do I will run this I mean, I mean I will open this into the Excel how system will what is the look and feel of the trial balance for a two years current year and two years right uh, 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 uh. 
is taking some time yeah very slow yeah mm -hmm. So here uh, system is loading the snapshot data uh, correct so here if we'll select uh, period 1 ok so that's how system will uh, run uh, for a multi uh, past two years data also system will fetch all the details let me select one of the main account this one okay uh, I'm selecting one of the main account yeah so you can see here a system have fetched 23 data 24 and 25 data okay uh, 23 and 25 data so that's how system will uh, run in uh, I mean generate the trial balance if you want to see multiple year of the trial balance into the single uh, single Excel form so we have option uh, to s run multiple uh, legal entity trial balance and we have option to run multiple years of uh, trial balance into one Excel so this is a new feature of um, of the trial balance snapshot I hope you like this video thank you all for watching this video